Hey there folks, it's Antar and I am back with a new Ubers battle. My Ubers team has been completely redesigned thanks to the wonderful people over at the Smogon Rate My Teams forum. And my opponent today, uh, my first opponent with this new variation on my team, is Google Knight, who's a really awesome guy. I've battled him a few times now. Anyway, he leads off with Groudon, as I was expecting him to do, as I lead off with my Reshiram, which is a Specs Reshiram, carrying the blue fair flare, boosted by the sun, and I'm like, I'm gonna destroy his team, and of course he sends out his own Reshiram, and I'm like, well, crap. Well, let's see how much blue flare does. I mean, so, this is boosted by the sun, Specs, Stab, crazy base power, and it does what, like a third? That's actually pretty darn impressive. So anyway, I'm predicting the Draco Meteor here, hoping he doesn't predict me. And uh, indeed, he's locked in, he's gonna switch out, and uh, he actually missed the Draco Meteor, which is actually kind of funny. Here I go for the Sword Dance on the Switch, predicting, you know, the Switch is obvious. And so here I'm thinking, well, what can Groudon do to me? Fire Blast? Okay, was not expecting. I really should have expected him to at least be carrying the Fire Punch. This was a needless loss of my Scissor. Uh, I really actually love having Scissor on this team. Scissor is one of those Pokemon that I swore to never use in, you know, OU and whatnot because it's just so overused. But in, in Ubers, it's not, you know, it's not awful. Anyway. Here I go for the Draco Meteor, expecting him to switch. Uh, he doesn't switch, and I manage to take out his Pangea in one hit. Yeah, it's really funny. He named his um, Pangea, I named mine Gondwana, so <laughs> it's just kind of funny. Anyway, now he sends out Mewtwo, and I'm thinking, okay, he's probably going to try setting up or something, and I don't want him to get some free setups, so I'm just going to go for the Draco Meteor on the first turn. He actually misses, balancing out the miss before. It's not like it would have done very much. I was at minus two, so that kind of sucks. Here I'm expecting him to keep on calm and I'm figuring my only hope is to phase this guy out. Um, my Gondwana is now bulkier, it's impish nature, um, it's running of lots of special defense EVs, and I was hoping I could survive, but at plus two it really wasn't looking very likely. That's okay, I didn't really need Gondwana yet, he carries Roar now instead of the Dragon Tail as well, that would have been nice. Anyway, I go ahead and send out Arceus, and I'm thinking, god I hope I can survive. He misclicks, which is so incredibly awesome for me. I go for the Shadow Claw, thinking it would probably KO, it doesn't KO, this is uh, Arceus Ghost type. Um, I think he, it was a misclick, I'm almost positive. Anyway, here he goes for a plus two side strike, I'm like, oh crap. There goes my Arceus. Luckily, at that range of health, I should be able to revenge kill. I actually survived! This is why Arceus is broken, this is why people hate Arceus. I survived a plus two stab side strike with 51 HP, that is insane. Anyway, um, I'm not, not sure what he's doing, he, what he's doing sending out his uh, Ray Crazy here. I was thinking maybe he'd want a revenge kill, but he can't with, with extreme speed, that's just stupid. So here he goes for the Dragon Dance, I'm like, oh, okay. Well, but I've got 242 HP, maybe I can survive on uh, Outrage? Oh, oh, Outrage, yeah. No, I'm not surviving that. But Arceus did its job, and I am one happy camper. So now he's at plus one, I'm gonna send out Daenerys, yes, Daenerys Targaryen, um, who cannot be harmed by fire. I'm gonna go for the spatial rend. I'm going to outspeed because I am scarfed, and I'm gonna be able to KO with one hit, and that is incredible. Bye bye, Ray Quaza. Now he sends out his own scissor, so maybe scissors use a little bit more often than I, I was expecting. Anyway, I go ahead and send out Booth, my Reshiram, and I'm thinking, yeah, Blue Flare, baby. He's gonna go ahead and go for the superpower, and that is going to hurt me quite a bit. Uh, yeah, so I'm thinking he might be banded. Mine is Life Orb. Um, I don't run the Roost, but maybe I should. Uh, anyway, uh, he goes ahead and sends out Andromeda, which is his Dialga. I actually have a Dialga that I traded for, or I got as a trade, um, that isn't... You're not going to see it on any teams more like, when likely, but it's named Einstein. Um, anyway, yeah, go for the blue flare. Boosted by the sun, even though it's not super effective, that is a one-hit freaking KO, so I'm happy there. Uh, now out is going to come his Reshiram. He's gonna go ahead and go for the Dragon Pulse, I figured. You know, I just need... I mean, I don't have a safe switch in, so I'm just gonna let Booth die. It did its job, it did a lot of killing, so I'm gonna get a free switch into Daenerys Targaryen, and I am going to go ahead and, um, go for the Spatial Rend, He's going to predict that and send out Karate Bug, and I'm thinking, oh crap, well, you know, we'll see. So I go for the Spatial Ren. It actually does a fair amount. I'm like, okay, well, maybe I'll just stay in. It's going to be a three-hit KO, um, assuming no hacks or anything. So I go for the no another one, uh, and he's going to go for the um, Superpower. As long as I can survive the Superpower, I should be in a pretty good situation. 
and indeed I survived the superpower quite well. Uh, he's going to go ahead and withdraw, and I was like, why would you withdraw? That seems very strange. He's down to his last two Pokemon, so he's now sent in his um, Daenerys target. Uh, uh, why am I saying that? He sent in his um, Reshiram as death fodder, and I'm thinking, why would you do that? I'm not sure, but anyway, I take it out, and then he sends out Karate Bug, and then I realize, oh, he probably has the bullet punch, and he's probably locked into it, and he probably wanted it to be at full strength, hoping he'd KO, I survive with 17 HP, and luckily none of my spatial runs missed, I ab I'm able to KO and win the battle. So I'm liking this team a lot more than I like the last version of this team. I hope you are as well. Comment, rate, subscribe, and challenge.